Hi, I'm Sheila Long O'Meara, Executive Editor with Furniture Today, coming to you live from the Leadership Conference in Florida, and I'm with Brad Rogers, Senior Vice President with Ashley Sleep Division. Thanks for taking the time. Thank you, Sheila. Glad you're here. Thank you. Glad to be here. We were just chatting about a couple of things that you guys have going on. Um, Really important and a big topic now is your onshoring of your mattress manufacturing. So tell us a little bit about the strategy behind that and what you've got going on. Right. Well, we, we've gone through a lot in the last couple of years. You know, that's no secret. Uh, you know, with the China anti-dumping, we had to pivot, and we uh, uh, we ended up in Vietnam. We had five great facilities there. We have several uh, campuses, Ashley does, mm-hmm. that were currently manufacturing product, and uh, but not no longer mattresses, obviously. So we once again had to pivot again. And we're very proud to say we've got a tremendous state-of-the-art facility in Salt Hill, Mississippi that's, uh, I think it's in excess of 750,000 square feet, just for our, our, our inner spring. Just for mat- inner spring mattresses. Right, right. And also, uh, we're very proud of the fact that uh, we're probably, I think we're pouring this week, or starting this week, we've got a brand new foam pouring facility as well with a state-of-the-art uh, uh, foam pouring uh, Material, okay. All the good yeah, stuff. All the good stuff. We so it's uh, it's fantastic. We've been the Wanex have invested a huge amount of money into this, and we are determined to uh, really go after it strong over the next uh, several years in the bedding. So is that foam pouring on the same campus, or is it close to down the street? No, the the foam pouring facility is in Verona, Mississippi. Okay. It's about 17 miles down the road from Saltillo. Gotcha. Okay, and I that, that facility is in excess of 400,000 square feet. So we have made major investments into the uh, uh, the foam pouring line itself. Uh, great storage facilities in the back, uh, state of the art gantry that allows us to store the buns. Then we'll go through the cutting process and uh, we'll make finished goods, finished finish product there in, Salt, in uh, Verona. So are you headed toward a vertical kind of manufacturing platform? Yeah, pretty much. We're as close to vertically integrated as you can get right now. Uh, we we manufacture our own coils in Saltillo mm-hmm. and in Advance as well. We've really got two manufacturing facilities now. Uh, the Saltillo facility and we also have a facility in Advance, North Carolina. Yep. And we kind of made that a little factory in a factory in a box, so to speak. Factory in a factory. Okay. And uh, so we, we added a facility there that that allows us to pick up about an additional 5,000 pieces a week. Uh, that makes it great, especially on the, those products that uh, are high velocity items. We can really focus on streamlining and getting that running through the factory. And uh, then our Saltillo facility, we end, overall we anticipate making about 45,000 pieces a week uh, going into next year. That That's a lot. And I'm sure with the increased consumer demand that's coming through this industry right now that's very helpful right and it's great because of the fact that we do manufacture our own coils we're now pouring our own foam mm-hmm. uh, we make our own fiber uh, we, we still utilize some of our uh, our suppliers that have been great partners for us in the past but uh, it's been a it's been a good fit and it's been great and the only thing we really aren't making ourselves is, is the tick so we still need the you know, the ticking manufacturers to truly really help us out, and we found some great partners there as well. Oh. So, yes, we are vertically integrated. Yeah, that sounds like. It yeah. sounds like. Um, what else can we expect from, from Ashley Sleep moving forward? Uh, well, it's, it's Ashley Sleep and Sierra Sleep. We, you know, very, very important that, that we understand that uh, uh, we like to take care of our primary accounts, our, our, our brick and mortar accounts out there. But what you can expect is great transition into uh, being in a very good inventory. Uh, we're focusing hard on, on, on building our inventories up so we can hit the ground running first next year. We aren't waiting for next year. We're starting now. Okay. We're doing it now. The focus is to get, is go out there, let's get our placements out, let's put our programs out there. What can you expect to see in the future? You can expect to see strong, continued, strong values. Our value pr- proposition is going to continue to grow. We're still going to offer some of the best values out there anywhere from 399 at one time it was 299 okay but we're going to be looking now at 399 yep. to 1999 and uh, that's that's where I feel like our advantages fall especially with the manufacturing capabilities that we have ah so we're looking for more growth from you in this category uh, yeah, we're looking for a lot more growth from us in the category <laughs> fair yes, point we will be having a lot more growth in the category fair point yes and we depend on uh, great retailers that we have 
you know, they're very excited about where we're going, with the direction that we're taking. They're very excited about, uh, you know, at the conference, I've talked to several dealers here and explained to them exactly where we're going, what we're doing, and they're excited. They're saying, bring it, let's go. It's, it's, it, it's time to grow the business. Nice, so, nice. It's looking good for Ashley Betting. Well, it sounds very exciting. Again, I appreciate you taking the time. I know it's kind of a busy time right now. Thank you. Thank you so much. I appreciate all y'all do for us. Uh, thank you. Y'all have a great day out there. Thanks. Again, I'm Sheila Long O'Mara with Furniture Today, and I've just spent some time with Brad Rogers from Ashley Sleep Division. And thanks so much.